What are and the then, cost of making the candle? Oh, I'm sure she doesn't want to re- reveal that, but let's just less okay, than well, $32. Do, <laughs> yeah, it is. But yeah. our margins, so we can obviously support a really strong wholesale business. Right. Yes. Um, and wholesale deals are typically 50% of your retail, correct. right? Mm-hmm. Yep. And that's what we do. Okay. So we you're still making money. The extra margin though. So they only wholesale for 14. Okay. So they can charge 28 to 32. So it's up to 32. them. Got, yeah. It. Yeah. Got it. And we give them that. And you still have margin on the 14. Absolutely. Big advice I always tell people is when you're starting a company, make sure you run the math on the wholesale because a lot of people think, oh, I'll just sell it to a wholesale at 80% of my co- or right. my retail price. And that's just not the case. Any yeah. good wholesaler or retailer is going to purchase your product for 40%, sometimes 50%. We had a deal with Barnes & Noble and they were like 40%. That's it. Wow. And I was like, that's crazy, guys. Yeah. But we yeah. had margin. And so but you, had, yeah. you could support it. If you mm-hmm. can't support it, then that's Right. And we thought, oh, that's fine. You that's know, good. we have the margin. Amazon. I have a guy who's setting stuff up for us right now. And he was like, I did the math prior. So I was like, is it about right that I'm only getting about 50% of this? And he was like, that's incredible for Amazon. Are you kidding me? I was like, really? Because I was thinking that as like, my wow. wholesale account. But I'm thinking after all the fees. Yeah. So Are you doing FBA? Like no. fulfilled by Amazon? No. When you White say Amazon, label? what do you mean? Well, they take whatever percentage of the fee. Also, I think a lot of people don't know this. When we offer free shipping with Prime, it's just yeah. built in. Like, yeah. you're still you're still paying for it. Someone's still paying for you're it. You're paying it's, for the shipping. It's not free. Yeah. Right. A lot of brands, you'll see if you if you were to even go to a store or on their own website, it's a few dollars more on Amazon. Yeah. Um, but it's free shipping. Right. Well, it's better that way because you hate seeing, let's hate say, 40 bucks and then you see it $6 yeah, in shipping right. and you're like, just, I'd rather just bake it in. Yeah. yeah. It's smart psychologically. That's right. Because then see. you know how much but you're But also living in LA, change. for me to go yeah. somewhere and buy something could take half an hour. It could take 45 minutes mm-hmm. when I can just <laughs> click online and it'll be there the what? same day. I know. What? It's your time. It's true. My it time is. is precious. So, but there's margin baked into your candle company, even with you shipping them. Correct. Which is great. And yeah. so, and they're heavy. And yeah. so the shipping is maybe like five bucks. We actually charge $8 okay. on our website. Okay. Do you Just use depending like, on where it goes to. It yeah. It averages out. We do a lot of free shipping promos. Yeah. yeah. And that that's always fun. That's like our number one thing. So, so the margins are there. And I think. Which is great. You did the math. It I works. I did the math. And that was yeah. the first part of it. You know, and I, I want to support the retailers. That's the big thing. And when you're meeting these retailers, do you know them because of your experience or is it. So we hired a showroom um, downtown. What does that mean? A showroom okay. to represent the products. So there are sales reps. Cool. Got it. Um, so we're in a showroom with probably 30 other brands. There's two other candle companies in there, but we're all in the same wheelhouse of home and gift. Cool. So a buyer goes in there and they're just like, oh, we can buy like, you know, really beautiful journals or yeah. you know, the candles are in there. They do a lot of kind of cool kid stuff. Um, nice. Tara, who was previously on yeah. Um, one of the episodes. Yeah, yeah to Soro, yeah. yeah. She has been going to that showroom for, I guess, like 20 some years. Wow. Um, they've been in business. Like, they're kind of the OGs yeah. of the home and gift world, and I knew I wanted them on my side. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's Karen Alwell Studio for anyone that does have stores. Amazing. So we give them, they get a commission. It's 15%. Okay. And we also pay a showroom fee. We have, we're represented in LA uh, year round. We're represented in Atlanta's showroom year round. And then they take us to New York now, which is the biggest home and gift show. Uh, in the country wow. twice a year and for seventeen thousand dollars you can you can spend your year doing that so, so seventeen thousand plus fifteen percent so just where just did, to be in these showrooms yes where did you learn of that from being because a buyer I was a buyer and i would go shop at showrooms so i'm like yeah. i'm not gonna i had no idea so instead of you going to all these trade shows you can just hire a buyer or not a buyer, Higher but a, a, showroom. a showroom, showroom and they go out and Correct. sell for you yeah and as long as you've done the math and the 15% margin that they take is baked in. Yes. And the showroom You get cost. free, effectively free marketing, okay, free right. labor. I hired a salesperson. Right. It's yeah. too expensive. $16,000, $17,000 is I'm going to start yeah. a company tomorrow, I think. This is amazing. <laughs> I'm ready. Wrapping the brands is yeah. kind of the move. Yeah. But I knew also, like, I've had huh. people cold call, and they're like, hi, I'm Linda from LA. <laughs> Linda. From Auntie Linda. Brands. Um, and they just make it, I'm like, well, unless you can... Can you send it to me? Can you come yeah. to me? Also, they're mm. thinking I'm in Michigan. I'm in LA. And I'm like, well, I'm in LA. What showroom are you in? Yeah. And if they don't have one, it's I'm not going to buy. Or what shows will you be at? Yeah. And they can't tell me that they'll be in Vegas or New York or Atlanta or LA. I'm not going to see your product. So I knew going in that that would have to be the first investment. Yep. Yeah. And it's paid off. And same thing. Built Credit that 15%. <laughs> 
Credit card and my own personal savings. Yeah. <laughs> JP hasn't taken a trip to Italy in a year. He's sitting at home waiting. He's just like, I can't wait to quit my IT auditing. Uh, yeah. You know, it's tough. It's tough. I'm sorry. JP. I gotta meet this JB. Right. <laughs> gotta suss him out. He's an awesome. Brooke kind of did this a little bit too, and I was like, oh god. Uh-huh. Can't wait to meet your husband. <laughs> we, we love Dennis. I was actually in Brooke's wedding. Oh, nice. Oh, amazing. Yeah, they're a great amazing. couple. That's awesome. Mm-hmm. So right now you sell online and then wholesale. Will you also do like Amazon fulfillment or, or eBay or no? Are you so focused we, on the wholesale? We've been on Amazon for a year with one product sitting on there because once I got in there, I realized. It's so sophisticated. Like you really have to know your way around it, and there's experts for that. Around what? The Amazon. Around Amazon, it's not just the same as your website where you you know put up a product description and a picture. No one's gonna find you. Yeah. It, no one's gonna like. It's all SEO. Yes, and, like, and that's something I don't know. And yeah. That's another big thing. Like I know what I don't know, and it stopped right about there at tech. Yeah. And you hired for that. Yep. Yeah. This did is your, actually with did Brian. JP able, was he able to do any of this? He's helpful in terms of like. Auditing. Technical things, yeah. <laughs> oh, he loves to audit the business. But I think that's why he supports it because yeah. he's like, wow, you're profitable. Yeah. It, pe- it like, pencils, Thank yeah. You. Thank yes. you. <laughs> yeah, everybody just do the math. I mean, that's yeah. that's the biggest advice. Mm-hmm. Add the shipping, add your showroom costs, bake right. that into add your, your time. business and make sure it pencils. Yeah, with yeah. labor in there. Yep. I went and sat with um, an accountant, Brooks accountant, and he was like, wow, he's like, so you, you went to business school. And I was like, no, we just... <laughs> It's not about business school. You don't need that. You just have to be smart about your numbers. Like yeah. I thought of every detail. I know. I mean, the WIC. It's such a small cost, but it's seven cents. That could make or break after a while. Totally. Yeah. To where mm-hmm. the money goes. Right. Yeah. There's a glue dot that sticks it to that. Mm. It's one cent. Like. Yeah. I put every single thing. You have that. to.